Hello, in this jQuery video, I am going to show you how to use the trim method. So the trim method allows you to you know, get a bit piece of string, not string in real life, that sort of thing that you would tie something with, but strings such as characters, and it gets rid of any you know, white space, so spaces on the start and at the end, not inside of it, just at the start and at the end. So let's create a little button, so I'm going to say button, Actually, I don't even need a button. I can do purely in JavaScript. But if I do, if I create a variable called epic string, or not, instead I'm going to say food equals pizza. And I'm going to put a bunch of empty spaces, you know, pizza with the text, and put loads of the end as well. Okay, so now if I do console.log, see what we get it's been printed out but it's got those empty spaces before it okay so if you want to get rid of them and one use case of this could be you have some sort of input form that's actually what I want you to do as an extra task use the skills that we've learned so far to you know have an input form which is basic HTML get it so using a selector in jQuery get that string and then apply the trim method to it so if you have an input form maybe it's some sort of registration form on your new amazing facebook 2.0 social media platform you don't want spaces at the start and at the end of let's say the username and you might let them type it in but you'll just get rid of it anything in between that's different but anything at start at the end you don't want it so to actually get rid of the this white space is really simple. All strings have a method called trim. So if we do food.trim or whatever the string is called, and I'm just printing it out directly, I could pass it to another method, a custom method as a parameter, I could assign it to a variable, whatever you want. So if I reload, as you can see, pizza is the best, and this no longer has the white space at the start and at the end. So that's it for the trim method, really simple stuff. It, it removes white space from both sides of a string. It doesn't actually change the original string, so any white space in between is left the same. Simple stuff. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.